this is a very important subject. We have a lot of Mississippians who work in the energy industry and a lot who are dependent upon energy. So I am pleased to announce today that Momentum Mississippi, our long-term economic development strategy task force, is creating the Mississippi Energy Policy Institute. It'll focus on the kinds of policies we've been talking about to promote the development of abundant, affordable American energy projects here in Mississippi, to seek solutions to the energy problem by working with our congressional delegation to make sure that what Washington does is solutions, not causing more problems. Uh, let me, I want to introduce a couple of people who are involved in this. I want to thank, I want to thank Anthony Tapazzi, who's the, the chairman of Momentum Mississippi and his group who've been working on this for quite a long time. Uh, I want to thank John Palmer, who you're going to hear from in a minute. Uh, Ambassador Palmer has agreed to lead this effort uh, as we get started. Uh, we will hand out for you in a minute uh, a list of all the members of the initial board of directors of the of the task force. And the good thing is it goes from uh, oil and gas and electric utilities to manufacturing, but also to agriculture because biofuels, we talked about ethanol and biodiesel, biofuels are going to be part of our energy future. And Mississippi is particularly well situated to be a major player there because of our timber uh, and also because of some of the crops that we do grow or can grow. So we've got agriculture uh, represented in this as well. Uh, as long as I'm governor, Mississippi's going to have an energy policy. And our energy policy is more energy, more American energy is what we need in the United States. Because if we have more American energy, we'll have more affordable energy. If you want to bring down the price of something, increase the supply. And that's what we're trying to do in all these projects in Mississippi.